crafty friends this is Julissa of Paper Gems by Jules and today I'm on a hop with Therma Web and Unity Stamp Company and we are featuring some of the new adhesive transfers that Therma Web has releasing and this collaboration is with Unity um, for this particular one so I am pairing it with an awesome Unity stamp that I thought was just so fun to celebrate with so watch the coloring for now I am fighting a bit of a cold so just mind my voice and I'll put on some music for now and then I'll tune back in once we start getting uh, getting to the foil. Enjoy! Okay, so before we get into the foiling, I wanted to also chat about what I'm doing right here. So something that I do with a lot of my cards is I stamp with a regular ink that is Copic friendly. And then once I'm done coloring, it's super risky, but I go back and I use VersaFine Claire or VersaFine. And I do that to get that bold black look around the image. Um, you have to have some sort of device. I use my Misty. I love my Misty, but that's the only way I'm going to line those items up, especially with a red rubber stamp. And I love my red rubber stamps. So just, you know, an idea to throw out there if you want that crisp, super, super crisp black look, or even if you wanted to use a brown ink, um, that's also another way to kind of make it a little softer, but still have a full line um, image. So just wanted to throw that out there um, in case you weren't familiar with that little technique. All right, and back to the music.
thanks so much for hanging in there so now what we're going to do is we're going to trim out the words that we want to use of these adhesive transfers so i trimmed out let's and celebrate and what i'm doing is i am going to lay them out on my white cardstock where i'm going to use them now i'm going to end up fussy cutting the let's um, and the celebrate from once it's foiled but i'll show you for now what happens so this has like um it basically has the word in a little very 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 thin adhesive so you can't really see it but you lay this down you peel the back and you lay this down right so i'm pressing it on there sometimes that's almost enough pressure but to be super safe what i would suggest is always run it through your um i have a big shot so whatever you have that's comparable use that and so i peeled it off and now you can kind of see a little bit of the glimmer of the glue that's on there um, and it's not a liquid glue it's just like a tacky little glue so you don't want to touch it um, you don't want to touch it when it's on the film and you don't want to touch it when it's on your paper so now i am trimming some red deco foil and I am pressing it on there now you don't have to do this again what you want to do is run it through your big shot but it is that simple you can already see that it's sticking to it so just bear with me put it through the machine and when it comes out wait till you see now the great thing about this is that you can use this on black cardstock on navy cardstock on whatever color cardstock you can use this because it's all going to depend on the color of the foil now just so you know that that clear version that can be foil too I didn't do it in this video but there is another unity video that does show you how you can use that piece too another part that you can use is the remaining foil so that foil that is now on the paper has taken away from the foil that was used over it well, you can use that on black toner paper and that's also available on unity's website as well as thermoweb so I'm just gonna fussy cut this out and then place it and you'll see how this all comes together I love this product I think you'll love this product. I hope you enjoy the hop. I hope that you are finding inspiration with all of the creativity that comes from this group. And I hope that you enjoy this video. So enjoy the rest of this. I'm going to tune out right now and just put on some music. Feel free to ask any questions in the comments. I'd love for you to subscribe and tell me what inspired you most. Thanks so much.